Here are the top AI stories from around the world for the week ending September 28, 2025. Our top story is a massive disruption in the economics of AI. A new model called DeepSeek R1 is achieving performance on par with GPT-4, but was trained for a mere $294,000, a fraction of the millions spent by its Western rivals. This is not just about cost, it's about access. As a peer-reviewed open-sourced model, DeepSeek R1 is democratizing state-of-the-art AI on a global scale. This signals a major shift in the industry, one that is already stoking price wars and challenging the entire cost structure of AI development worldwide. From market disruption to global security, we now turn to the United Nations, where a high-level debate is underway on the future of AI in warfare. UN Secretary General Antonio Guterres made an urgent plea calling for a ban on all autonomous weapon systems that operate without human control. Key proposals on the table include establishing clear regulatory frameworks, an explicit ban on using AI for nuclear command and control, and urgent efforts to bridge the AI capacity gap that's growing between nations. As the debate over AI safety intensifies, Italy has taken a decisive step. The nation has just become the first member of the European Union to pass its own comprehensive AI regulations, fully aligned with the landmark EU AI Act. The Italian law introduces specific, robust measures, including strict child protection rules that restrict AI access for anyone under 14 without parental consent. Furthermore, it establishes severe criminal penalties for the creation and distribution of malicious deepfakes and for using AI to commit fraud signaling a new era of enforcement. In news that will change how billions of people use the internet, Google Chrome is being infused with powerful new AI capabilities. Users will now be able to query and summarize web content directly within the browser, effectively having a conversation with the web page itself. The new AI assistance also allows users to seamlessly compare information across multiple open tabs. These features, along with the ability to automate browsing tasks are fundamentally blurring the lines between a traditional web browser and a proactive AI assistant. Now for a major breakthrough in healthcare, Stanford University has developed MedAgent Bench, the first ever benchmark to test AI agents in real-world electronic health record scenarios. The results are stunning. Top AI models can now successfully complete 70% of tasks designed for human clinicians. This development is a significant step towards addressing critical staff shortages in healthcare while rigorously testing AI's readiness for deployment in real-world medical applications. In a milestone moment for AI reasoning, an AI has won gold. Google DeepMind's Gemini 2.5 achieved a gold medal at the International Collegiate Programming Contest, one of the world's most prestigious competitive programming events. The AI outperformed its elite human rivals in complex dynamic optimization tasks this victory marks an unprecedented leap in AI's ability to reason and solve problems in highly competitive real-world scenarios. Turning to the future of computation itself, researchers at Caltech have just announced a monumental achievement in quantum computing. They have constructed a massive neural atom array containing 6,100 qubits. More importantly, this array has demonstrated the ability to maintain a long-lasting superposition. This is a critical step forward, solving a key challenge on the path to developing powerful, highly accurate, and error-correct quantum computers. The race for AI dominance is fueling an unprecedented global investment in infrastructure. In a move to bolster transatlantic tech ties, Microsoft has announced $30 billion to build out the UK's AI infrastructure. Meanwhile, a network of AI factories powered by NVIDIA GPUs is being built across Africa with completion expected by 2026. This investment is also being targeted at critical sectors as experts advocate for using AI to revolutionize farming practices and combat food insecurity on the continent. Beyond infrastructure, AI is delivering tangible applications that are changing patient lives. At the University of South Australia, new machine learning models are helping clinicians determine which patients can safely discontinue long-term antidepressant use. In another development, an Australian AI tool is now able to predict 
a woman's 10-year risk of heart diseases simply by analyzing her mammogram and age, integrating heart health screening directly into breast cancer screening. We now turn to what may be the single largest AI investment in history, dubbed the Stargate Project, a partnership between OpenAI, Oracle, and SoftBank has revealed plans for a colossal undertaking. The project involves a 400 billion investment over the next three years to build five massive new AI data centers in the United States. These facilities are designed to provide seven gigawatts of capacity and are expected to create an estimated 25,000 jobs across new sites in Texas and New Mexico. The global AI landscape is being redrawn by a major counteroffensive from China. Tech giant Alibaba has launched Gwen3 Max, a new trillion parameter AI model that excels in code generation and is positioned as a direct rival to leading US models. This push extends globally with Alibaba leveraging a partnership with NVIDIA to build new data centers in Brazil and Europe, significantly enhancing its enterprise AI capabilities on the world stage. The growth of AI is also accelerating in military domain with significant new developments. North Korean leader Kim Jong-un has declared the development of AI-powered military drones a top priority, a move that is escalating regional tensions and highlighting AI's role in modern warfare. In Europe, Germany's Circus SE has become Meta's official partner to integrate Lama AI into defense robots, a major step towards enhancing Europe's own military AI autonomy. As the AI industry matures, we are seeing a rush to form critical partnerships and set global standards. Databricks and OpenAI have announced a partnership to integrate GPT-5 into enterprise platforms, a deal projected to generate over $100 million in revenue. In a move to solve data challenges, Snowflake is leading a new coalition along with other companies such as Salesforce to create the Open Semantic Interchange, OSI, a universal standard for data interoperability. At the same time, the call for safety is growing louder with over 200 Nobel laureates urging the UN to establish enforceable AI safety regulations by 2026. With that, we come to the end of the show. Support our work by joining us as a member and we sincerely hope that you will like, share, and subscribe to the